Hey everybody, welcome back to Deus Ex. I am doing, I guess, the last side point here, which is side missions. I see points of interest in history, though. Um, I don't know what these mean, though. So, I still have to do travel to Parekaziza. So we'll do that one. I, I just can't pronounce that word. I can't fucking... Dude, okay. I understand when things are said. I don't really... What's this? Well, I don't fully understand when things are said all the time. But I, I, I just can't read it. That's something I learned how to do. I don't know. I, I just never spent that much time. Because my... My folks would speak Czech, right? So, you know, things like that. Alright, so we're going down there. Meet tra meet document agent. Alright, this is a place you've never been to. I wonder why it just kind of like shoves us out of the these side missions. Because this place is big and expensive enough that I assume we will be returning here at one point. But I guess something's going to change. You know, I'd totally skip over these loading screens. But they're actually kind of like interesting. The fact that... <laughs> you can see people on the subway. Although, you know what? I'm gonna say now, it's the same fucking people on the subway. And they're always all logs. Seems to be a lot of ogs in the city that fucking hates them. Alright, let's go in here. I'm authorized personnel. Oh, do I have any, uh... Actually, now that I think about it. No, I don't have any more uh, Praxis points. I wouldn't mind actually getting that wall hacks vision again, because it was actually kind of nice. Wow, there's actually literally nothing in here. But you know what? That's only to the untrained eye. There's actually something in here, guys. I just have not figured out where it is. This is too heavy. Wow, there really isn't anything here. That I'm fucking blind, which ha has happened on K uh, from time to time. I think I just felt the need to have that there, since every other subway station has it. Hello, civilian. Good afternoon, sir. My name is Felice Almond, and I represent the Santo Group. We are looking for able-bodied augmented persons like you to help us create the future. Well, you fucking hate everyone. Don't take this the wrong way. But this might be the wrong town to hawk a dream of the future in. Don't you think it's exactly the right one? Prague, a city with no respect for the choices its citizens made to become augmented. The choice you made. And you're going to tell me Santos found a city that does respect us? We're making it. You can't deny the world has to change. For the better, this time. Augmentations helped us take great steps before, and we can do it again. In Rabia, a concept city, 3D printed, beyond state of the art, a symbol of evolution. In the deserts of Oman, I've seen the new stories. But Santo's not a charity, and I don't think your stakeholders are philanthropists. That's why they've asked people like me to spread the word, to make an offer. Incentive-driven employment for any augmented person. You'll get a sponsored work permit for the duration of the city's construction. And after that? A guaranteed place in the residency lottery. Be cynical. You're asking Augs to sign themselves up to a future that was made in a laboratory and built in a desert. Seems a little utopic. You must think when I close my eyes, I see the script they ask us to read from. On message, they call it. But I don't. I see Rabia. Santo is the only corporation in the world to increase its augmented workforce in the past two years. Did you know that? That must be convenient for a construction business. It's the opposite. Our CEO's life has been threatened for supporting the legitimacy of augmented people. But he, Mr. Brown, understands that the augmented saw the future early and rushed to meet it. I thought the Udalek complex was Santos' future for the augmented. From what I've heard, it didn't go to plan. Not to our plan. Utelek was supposed to be a low-cost, 
high-volume housing solution for transient workers. It was never meant to become what it has. And why didn't Brown step in? Doesn't look good to have your name associated with an all ghetto. It's out of our hands. Since the incident, it's been run by the Czech state and their police. That will never happen with Rabia. What guarantee do I have that life in Rabia is different than the segregation here? Or is that a lottery too? Santo is the guarantee. We keep the rights to the city in perpetuity, never handing it off to people who want the augmented out of sight and out of mind. But that's still exactly what you're doing. A city in a bubble, born from fear between augmented and non-augmented. There have always been divisions in society. There always will be. That's why there are walls. Someone has to build the walls, and that's Santo. So this incentive program, positioning Rabia for the Augs, it's all on Nathaniel Brown? Everything. The industrial printing of the city, the archaeological design, the recruiting drive, even the street teams. Mr. Brown met us personally to sign off on us. Would you believe it? Yeah, I think I would. Archaeological? Architectural ecology. Rabia is zero footprint, fully self-sufficient. It is not just his solution for the augmented, it is his solution for cities. It is visionary. There is no other word for it. Right. Unfortunately, most of the visionaries I've met were so busy chasing their grand plan, they lost sight of the little people. You've given me a lot to chew on. I can't sign up with you on the spot. Just consider it. What I've told you. I'm not trying to sell you the e-brochure of Rabia. You've seen it all anyway. They're just pictures and holograms. I want you to believe in the place. Yeah, okay. That's weird. All right, so City for Ogs. That's what we're, we're, we're doing here. Santo says they're going to make the future a better place. They should concentrate on fixing the present. We won't push you aside. You know, I have to say, though, so there's a central theme of this game that has been kind of obvious so far which is like essentially the discrimination of Augs but it seems really kind of like it's a bit on the unrealistic side side to be honest I won't lie I'm gonna take your bullets oh shit uh what the fuck they're shooting me ah that's the first time I've ever been shot at when I fucking uh <laughs> when I've stole shit from a truck for, for some reason, I, I, I thought they just didn't care. I'll continue my thought, I guess, in a second. Just need to find out where, where, where I load from. Okay. I'm hoping I had that conversation with her already. Um, like, it just seems a bit on the... I don't know. They're, they're forcing this theme. Like, they wanted to force this theme, but they wanted to be, I guess, politically correct about it. Because, obviously, the theme is... Related to, I guess, like, I don't know, like, perceived racism and all that kind of other, other shit and all that kind of other garbage. Uh, like, what, like, you, it's obvious. Like, I don't need to fucking explain, explain any of this. Uh, can we actually go here? Church key card. Alright, I guess we'll be back there at some other point. So, they're trying to make you think and relate it, kind of, in a way, to those kinds of things. And... As I said, just me personally, I just don't see it because it's like it's it's it just seems kind of silly to me. Um, I mean, I guess I don't know if there's some sort of like propaganda against like Augs or something after that whole like incident in the in the last game. Um, it's very possible though. I don't know. You looking? This area is restricted to you, Org. See, I just don't know why people are just fuckers. It doesn't make any sense to me. Looking for permit. Ah, uh, it's document agent. I was stopped by someone named Drahomir at a checkpoint. He sent me here. Apparently, you help Augs with documentation, upgrade their permits. You have the money. Maybe. You want to tell me what I'm paying for exactly? You pay to get your name on the list. Melina upstairs. She works on your shiny new permit. You come back in one week to pick it up. Standard pickup fee will apply. 
How much do you charge people for this? Not people. Augs. 35,000 credits. You're not even trying, are you? You just blatantly scam Augs out of as much as you can. You want updated permit or not? Documents are actually pretty good. You'll see. Trust me. The girl is very talented. These documents, what are they? Stolen? Forged? Invisible? Look. Just give me what you have, and I'll put your name on the list. That's how it works. Melina does surprisingly good work. Puts more effort in than we ask her to. <laughs> Insult. This is as much as I'm willing to give you. So what kind of shiny new permit does this get me? Fucking tourist. You're wasting my time, Og. <laughs> Wonder what that fun of guy. Let's confront the forger upstairs. That's easy. I'm getting a little worried. They literally give me a path here. <laughs> like it's like one of those things like I, I look I look at it myself and I'm like, how do you even like tell someone's an og? Because like if I if I was like let's say in the same situation, you know, just where like how does everyone tell Jensen's an og? Just put some fucking gloves on, Jensen. The glass could be just something really cool. Oh, I augmented my fucking glasses. I didn't get taken over, it's fine. I don't know, this shit makes no sense to me. Alright. Uh, is this this guy's comp uh This guy's uh, apartment? I don't know, I don't think so. Is a beer. Oh, there we go. Ten mil pistol. I probably should get a like a laser sight and actually use a ten mil pistol though. I don't know. I'll see what what my lot is. I actually I am not a huge fan of that stunt gun. I won't lie. And this is some boring ass book. Can we open the door? No. Is there anything else? Yeah. Can I just sneak over it's here? Rid of those train cars. Creeping me out. You think after Rosika business would be up? Even okay. You no should look. Oh, I, I don't know where he is. I think he's just right below me. Getting a little I think I'm supposed to He's sneak like around here. Let's see. That was a vent right there, actually. We'll go to the vent in just a second. It's like my energy here recharge. Actually, wait, this this doesn't lead anywhere new, really. Oh, shit. It smells like violence. I like it. <sighs> you do a takedown. Fuck it. There, I just some shit. All right, let's go in here. Oh man, we got some fucking laser grids now. How fucking deep is this shit? Go. 
I mean, we could just crouch one of these. These are really shitty laser grids. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. Okay. I didn't realize there was a camera there. Probably should have just activated Cloak to begin with. You know, I have that AUG sprinting thing, and I don't use it at all. It was alerted. Tactical shotgun? Sure. Ah, uh, we're getting fucking deep into this now. Alright, what's this one? Uh, she just wants to change the security code. Birth year of his previous Metica. Okay, so 980. 1980. Holy fucking shit, though. Alright, we got a camera overlooking that. Oh, there's also a security console right here. And a fragmentation mine. Well, it's... There's this code database. 1980. That's a really shit password. Alright, cameras, turn them off. Open the door. Frag laser. Oh, that's what those do. They're frag lasers. Please don't shoot me. You want to tell me what's going on here? Arts and crafts? I think you work for those scam artists out there. Or do they work for you? It was never meant to be a scam. More like uh, social services for the disaffected. You know, like no AUG left behind. Looks like a forgery ring to me. I hate the word forgery. I prefer graphic arts activism. I, I help people to, to be other people. And seriously, try getting anywhere with forgery on your resume. You're involved in something that takes advantage of people, and you're worried about your resume? That, that may have come out wrong. I mean, yes, career is important, but it's not everything. I know that. I, t I tend to get really nervous when I'm stressed. I, I mean, I, I'm stressed when... Which always just makes things worse. Oh, okay, look. I have no reason to be nervous here, do I? You're totally on my side, right? One of the good guys. Not like Drahomir. Yeah, goodbye. Sure. Your friends are out there intimidating Augs, preying on their fears of getting deported. And it seems like you are part of that. You'll be lucky not to go to jail. I'm already in jail. You think they let me leave this place? Drahomir tells people he's a cop, but he's not a cop. He's a bum who stole a uniform and a gun, which he points at people like me to make us do whatever he wants. What was I supposed to do? I sit here and I make the best documents I can. You were helping those thugs to extort people. That doesn't get much sympathy with me. The extortion part sucks. I swear to you, I'm totally anti-extortion. Obviously. Let me explain better. The government, they print up these official permits each month. But they only sell them to the rich corporate and military allies. Meanwhile, the other orgs, they get cattled out of the city because their documents aren't up to date enough. That's what was happening to my friends. Whatever your intentions here, you're part of a criminal operation. So that's what the shady types were all about? Gee, thanks for pointing that out. The gun in my face wasn't a clear enough indication. The city cracking down on forgeries and my friends all getting deported anyway. That was all part of my master plan here. When things got out of hand, obviously I wanted to stop. Why didn't you? I was scared. Drahumir said he would kill me. Looked at me kind of... like you're looking at me now. You're not going to kill me, are you? What do you think? I'm not sure yet. Look, the real problem is Drahumir and that checkpoint of his. Without him in the picture, the rest of them couldn't run a lemonade stand. Maybe you could... 
You know. You think I just walk around shooting people? Don't you? I like knowing there are other options. Okay, so stab him, scare him, or get the police to do their job for once. I remember Drahomir mentioning this cop who threatened him. She was hanging around his checkpoint. Who knows? Maybe there really is one good cop in Prague. That sounds like the safest bet. Otherwise, you're asking me to pick a fight with a bunch of guys in uniforms, scam artists or not. The whole city would come down on you. Still, up to you how you want to handle it. Right. And just so we're clear, you are going to stop forging documents now. I don't like getting into trouble. And even worse is other people suffering because of me. No more faking documents ever again. Unless someone really, really needed one. Then I'd probably do it. I mean, if we knew for a fact that we could help someone, we should do whatever we can, right? Yeah, well, I want it. It depends what you have in mind. The docs I make, they really can fool the authorities. Sort of. Sort of. Drachmir flooded the streets with forgeries, so the city started tracking more, adding scanners, validation numbers. Now, unless one of my permits gets activated in the city database, it's just plastic. So you're telling me these people pay for forgeries and then probably get deported anyway? It doesn't have to be that way. I have two permits that I literally just made. And I think we can really help these people. If you're willing. Do I want to help? Fine. Alright, how do we help? Their names are Edward Broad and Irenka Bauer. Drahomir was going to charge them like 20 more times. But maybe you could just give them the forgeries? Early Christmas present? You said it's just plastic that people get deported anyway. How does this help them? I think I know how to get them activated. As long as you're willing to follow through. All right. I'll go meet Edward and Irenka. In the meantime, are you going to be okay here? Once they learn that Drahomir has been taken care of, the others will leave me alone. He's the one I'm scared of. By the way, there is a safe over there where they keep their money. I'll give you the code. 2489. Feel free to help yourself. What about you? Way ahead of you. Hey, do sex music. Oh, that's the that's the sweet tunes of the future. Uh, I don't want to read ebooks. I like a, a a ten millimeter gun with like absolutely no ammo in it. <laughs> All right, let's safe over here. How is this a safe? It's a fucking ventilation shaft. Ah, oh, here's the safe. Two, four, eight, nine. Whoops. Four, eight, nine. Sorry, my bad. Unlock. Frag grenade, frag grenade, and how much money is that? Nine hundred. Okay, considering they were gonna charge me like out the fucking ass, not a lot of money. They are forgery thugs now. It's a good thing we're facing thugs. If we were facing good honest citizens, I would I would have a problem with that. So wait, how, how does it want me to leave now? Just like through the front door? You think after Rosica, business would be up. All right, so what's our objectives now? I guess we decided to help her out. Travel to Denavi something. No, it's this one. Deal with thing. Okay, so we could just we could we could just kind of fucking snipe his ass. I I, I want to do that. I'm I'm pretty good at dealing with uh, people. Oh, okay, so there he is. All right. So let's see. What's a good fucking sniper vantage point? Right up there. Right up there. 
All right, let's get up there. This is why we have jumping. Okay, jumping failed. We need Plan B. I want to get up. I want to get up on the top there. Hello, officer. Moment. All right. Pairs like they do not really want you jumping onto the rooftops. God damn it. Alright, here we are. Here we are. Here we are. Okay, this is not the right angle. <laughs> Fuck, let me down. Well, can I can I shoot him from invisibility? Is the question. Yeah, let's let's give it a try. I'm gonna save it. Can I like prone or anything? Okay, let's go. Deal with what? Deal with him. Okay. Do 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 do. Is that him? Bitch, you're in the way of a fucking assassination here. All right, I think that's him. Shit, she saw me. I've got an update on your friend Dramir. I've seen Drachovir pretend to be many. I didn't do anything. My friend was never one of them. It's been taken care of. He's not gonna be a problem anymore. Thank God. I don't know how you did it, but I'm glad you did. Listen, if you ever need documents for something, I'll be fine. Thanks. We were oh, cool. But terror and pain have turned us into souls. There is something struggling within. Moments when something enters into us. Thoughts come upon us which are not of us. We feel what we did not used to feel. We hear voices teach us to have children so that we may love them. Primus, is that you? Are you a Rinka Bauer? Who are you? Please take whatever you want. Just leave us alone. I didn't come here to take anything. You haven't? Irenka, she gets very scared. Whatever you've come to tell her, you should first tell me. I... I am the robot Helena. Irenka is not well. We must shield her. Irenka paid someone to make her an odd permit. To keep her from being taken to Gollum City. That someone wants to come through. Really? If, if that's true, she'll be... We'll be very happy. If we can stay in Prague, maybe they'll even... There was once a great play that predicted so much. Robots, revolutions, the future of mankind. She memorized all of it. It's her way. It's my way of trying to understand. I'll take your word for it. Here. This permit is good enough to fool anyone who takes a look at it. Does... does this mean I don't have to hide anymore? It's not that simple. You're still in danger. The permit needs to be activated. Otherwise, a routine scan will mark you for Gollum just the same. I don't understand. Sorry. There's no legal way for you to stay here. You should prepare for the worst. Uh, I... Uh, we don't know how to prepare. I'll take care of the activation. Just keep a low profile until I can get it sorted out. Thank you. We appreciate it. The fuck did I stumble into here? So where do you guys think Edward is over there? All right. Like I, I, I killed the guy, then come down here, and then there's like this shit going on. They're very confused. Okay, they seem they seem to be very upset about the fact that I just killed a police officer. I'm not sure why. Might have to do something with the fact that I killed a police officer. Oh, they knew I was here. Okay, well, it's just, uh, engage cloaking. What the fuck? They know I'm here. Okay. It's all- it's all because that- that butthole saw me. <laughs> Let's try it again. I'm gonna just fast forward it when I do it successfully. 
Because I'm pretty sure I could do it like that. Oh, right, here we go. Sniper rifle. Where's my... Oh, yeah, there's there my sniper yep. rifle. Milena, I've got an update on your friend Dravmir. I've seen Drachomir pretend to be many saints. My friend was never one of them. It's been taken care of. He's not gonna all be right. a problem anymore. Let's, let's try going past this all. Whoops. He's not gonna be a problem anymore. Thank God. I don't know how you did it, but I'm glad. Alright, let's, let's try this out. Listen, if you ever need documents for something, I'll be fine. Thanks. So I could just kind of cloak past this. Yeah, see, I'm not suspicious at all. It's fine. Yeah, that's it. Problem solved, guys. Oh, dude, everyone's like upset now because I snapped some bitch. What the fuck is happening here? Get lost, dog, before we turn our attention to you. Sitting on some cash grab. Thank you so much for what you've done. I, I, okay. Seems to be a good day. Just killing people. No, I'm, I'm here to rob you. All right, let's see what's on your laptop. Uh, well, that guy's dead, so you don't have to worry about him. <laughs> Thank you. I, I didn't know what to do. There are not many people a man like me can call on for help. What did they want? What everybody wants. Money. To feel strong. At first I thought they were here to take me away. Any moment now, they will take me away. Maybe it doesn't have to come to that. Don't get an old man's hopes up. Unless... My daughter? Did she send you? She did, didn't she? Why else would you? Please, tell me. When can I see them? No, that's not who sent me. You paid someone for an AUG permit. Do you remember? Oh, yes. Those officers who stopped me. Sure, I remember. They charged me three times already. Said it was a very complicated process. I knew it wouldn't get me anywhere. But you kept paying? I was desperate. I would pay a hundred more times if it meant I could stay close to my family. To what is left of them. I want to stay in Prague. Where's your family now? They're here in Prague. There are places I can go sometimes from where I can catch glimpses of them, and at least I know they're all right. You never speak to them? Maybe someday. I think I still have a chance with my grandson. Children are better at forgiveness than adults. Is it not true? better at forgetting. Why did you get augmented in the first place? When my children had children, I wanted to keep up with them, mentally and physically. I wanted to take them to the park, push them on a swing. All of this was before the... you know. Before the incident. Right. Incident. How ironic, hmm? I get augmented so I can be closer to them, and now... And now, it's not permitted. What happens if they catch you without a valid art permit? They'll take me to that complex they built. Golem City. Are you ready for that if it happens? Not one bit. I'm an old man. I'd rather die somewhere that's familiar than live somewhere that's not. Golem City. Pfft. It's for criminals and revolutionaries. I am neither. Here, this permit should fool anyone at a glance. I remember the officer saying I would have to pay again. Is that true? Ah, <laughs> yeah. You know the drill by now. Of course. You know, in my day, everything had only one price. Uh, here. So, what now? Do I have to activate something? 
I can put on my nice coat if necessary. If I have to wait in line, I'll wait in line. I don't complain. The situation's a little less legal than that. Oh. Do you need me to break in somewhere? I'll take care of it. Just try to keep a low profile until I figure out how to validate your number. All right. I can do that. I will wait here. How, how can you even tell this guy's augmented? It's just the thing he has on his forehead. Elena, I met with both those augs you made permits for. Now what? There is a computer at the government kiosk that handles the augment permit registry. You'll have to... access it. Quote, unquote. You mean break in? The code to the server room is 6788. Be careful, there may be other forms of security. Alright, I got it. Alright guys, uh, that's all the time we got for today. Next time we will continue. Uh, take care everyone, bye.